Hey, lovely people. This is Trey with OCD for OCC. Um, happy 2022. Uh, um, this is going to be a little bit of a haul. Um, I guess technically it is my first haul of 2022. Um, I have picked up a few things here and there, but I would consider this the first haul. Um, I went out to my local dollar store. Uh, I need a few um, containers and, um, yeah, type of container things. And, of course, they have Valentine's stuff out and Easter stuff out. So I went around and snagged a bunch of stuff. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be doing as many hauls as I did last year, but trying to focus on um, essential items this time around. Um, I will show you though what I picked up at Walmart last time I was up just because um, they got their Valentine's stuff out. Well, they don't have a lot of it out, but um, they have some stuff is out. And of course, this is a flamingo, so I had to get it uh, for $3.98. I decided that was worth it see a lot of flamingos now and this one's not gonna stand up <laughs> she's really cute she's got a glittery crown and glittery beak she's got glittery feet and on her furry um, part her wings and body it's hard to tell. I don't know if you can see from here, but they're like glittery stars on her. It's really hard to see them, but they're like iridescent. She will not stand up. There, stay. And then I, I snagged this cute little el uh, elephant. <laughs> <laughs> Octopus, because um, they're quite uh, difficult to find as a plush. And they also have little iridescent stars stuck to him. He's really cute. So, definitely do an ocean theme again. And I think that one could go for boy or girl. Okay, so today, um, there's quite a few Valentine things I like to um, snag up. Definitely these bracelets. Uh, they are in a 12 pack for $1.50. They're heart shaped. Um, I, I don't, yeah, I guess the same color as they were last year. Uh, so I did get, uh, one, two, three, four of those because they're really cute. <laughs> um, Valentine's, Valentine's. I snagged this. I think it was a dollar. Um, it's got these cute little soft uh, hair ties in it that I had I had picked up a bunch last year and used them. Um, I got this little guy. He was in a mug actually, but I just wanted him because he's a he's a tiger and. It's kind of hard to find tigers, plush tigers. I think he's really cute. So I snagged him. He has a, came with a mug, but obviously I'm not going to put the mug in there. But, um, let's see. What else is Valentine's? This cute little stuffy, I couldn't really resist. Um, my, usually their stuffies at the Dollarama are $4.00. And some of their smaller ones could be three or two fifty, but usually they're four dollars now. Um, it's a pig with wings. <laughs> He's really, really cute. I couldn't resist him. Um, some stuff in here that's mine. I think that's the last of. The Valentine's stuff. 
So Easter stuff. I really like to look in the Easter section because they always have bunnies, bunny stuff, which I always like to do. I did quite a few bunny boxes last year. Um, I picked up these really cute socks. And the bunny part's kind of fuzzier. $1.25. Uh, they're for a toddler, I think. Two to four. And the same size, these ones. They kind of look gray, but they're blue. They're blue, not gray. Um, I picked up these. They got these hair clips back again and uh, this color scheme set is my favorite one these are a 12 pack for a dollar there's really not much at our dollar stores that's just a dollar um i got this cute little keychain that's a big like a pom big really soft furry pom-pom with bunny ears it's really really cute Um, and I also picked up these that were in the Easter section. These are just, um, plastic bangle bracelets, uh, 12 for $1.25. I picked up one, two, three of those. Um... in the Easter section was this cute little book. It is very, very cute. I think it had a sticker on there. It has a little fluffy belly. It was $3, but it's really a nice little size. It's called Furry Bunny. It's really cute. Really cute little board book. I didn't really mind paying $3 for Oh, look, it has a cardinal. <laughs> it's really cute. So I did splurge on that a little bit. Um, they have these, which are new, little packages of um, hair accessories in this little resealable, reusable package, which is neat. Uh, these are $1.25, and this is like a green and blue set um it has two hair clips uh looks like a satin scrunchie and set wait how many six one two three four six i think hair ties so i got the green aqua kind of color and then i got the pink one which also has some gray in it which would be good for a bunny box for all the girls uh, they also had these cute little um, sets in their hair accessory section. has a little comb with some soft hair ties, and I'm guessing this is a mirror, although I cannot see it. Yes, it is a mirror, but it's, no, I don't, it's definitely not glass. It just has a protective cover over it. I thought these were really cute. Um, they had Frozen, they had LOL, um, uh, they had a princess one, which I also got the princess one. I think they had another one. Princess, Frozen, LOL, um... There might have been another one. I can't quite remember. But they were $2 each. Uh, I picked up this. That was in the craft section. It is a little wooden ornament that you can paint. And it makes... It looks like it makes two. Yeah, it makes two birds. 
for $1.25 because I'm definitely going to be doing a bird, a very special bird box. Um, they had these little 80 sheet notebooks. And I snagged this one again because it really, really goes well for the shoe box. Um, and that's what I actually, that's my, uh, my line. That's, they put my line on a book, um, where I put in, uh, the little inside covers in the box. You are loved is what I always said. So I got another one of those that went in, um, last year's flamingo box. Uh, a few new toys they had. Um, they did have a few Hot Wheels. I normally don't like to spend or to buy Hot Wheels at our Dollarama because the Hot Wheels at our Dollarama are $1.50 each, I think, which is kind of crazy. But uh, they had some pink ones, which if there's any girly ones i will definitely buy because they're very hard to find so they have this race car that's pink um speed blur indy 500 oval so i always i, I absolutely love the girly uh hot wheels that they came out with and then they had this one too um which sort of looks like a carriage. So they have a little teddy bear in there, but obviously the teddy bear's not it. Oh, yes, it is. It's just not white. That's really cute. It says it's a girl. <laughs> diaper, dra diaper dragger. So that's like, uh... oh, okay. So the hot, apparently there's Hot Wheels that, um, I think my son had one. It was, I don't think it was a shopping cart. But I've seen a shopping cart one. And they have little plastic men that I believe you can take out and unattach and stuff. We'll see, this one has little handles here. Which they explain right here. You can hook on your Hot Wheels man or lady or whatever to it. So it, yeah, it's basically like a carriage. And it's kind of cute. It doesn't come with a person, but... Um... They had these, which I was kind of excited about, um, these plastic animals. I've never seen them before. They're not painted the greatest, like, like, see his nose is really, his nose is completely off. The black for his nose is a, a lot more on his fur than on his nose, but, um, they're made quite solid. Uh, they were dollar twenty-five, and I thought they were they were pretty good, pretty decent. Like the painting's not terrific, but I thought they were kind of cute and a pretty good price for a little um, hard plastic animal. So I got a bear. Um, I got two. The tags keep coming off these two of the uh, giraffes which look in a lot better shape than the bear they look pretty good the detail looks a lot better so i got two of those um i got a leopard or jaguar whatever you want to call him he's pretty good too not too bad detail uh the lion I got a lion, which is pretty good too, actually. And I got this cute polar bear. I wish they had more than one, but they only had one of them. Because I definitely plan to do some more Arctic boxes. And he looks really good too. I wish they had a penguin. Um, so, and then I found this cute little... Uh, triceratops, I think. It is a dinosaur that you can take apart and put back together. Um, it was 250. It says zero to three, not recommended. Um, 
I would think a nine-year-old would still enjoy it. So I'm thinking of having a, putting in as a five to nine. Um, let me know what you think. But it's really cute. They had another uh, green colored one too. And then I splurged on these. Um, because you definitely can't, well, it's a splurge to me, but they're definitely more expensive, like at Walmart. They had a few of these, Trackmaster Thomases. Um, they didn't have very many, but I think they had like five or six. Um, they were $4 each, so I know that's cheaper than Walmart. At Walmart, they're probably like, uh, I would assume they were under $10, but you never know, really. I would just, I, I'm guessing they're probably around $8 at Walmart. Um, they are metal, and they just are a push-along kind, and they come with their own little caboose, Edward and James. So I thought they were a really good wow item for a train box. Because I still have train material, I believe. So, that's my little haul, my little Dollarama haul, which was pretty decent. Um, I, I did get a few things, but overall this was under $100. Uh, my total came to a little over 100 but as I said, I got some things. So, um, I thought it was good. Um, since I'm not going to be doing hauls all, a lot, like I did last year, but, um, seasonal shopping is what I'm doing, and essential, essential, um, and I, I see that a lot of things that I was buying in bulk, excuse me, and buying in bulk, um, from Amazon are no longer available, no longer available, um, like, you know, like, um, bulk pencil sharpeners, um, the Frisbees, although I think they did come back in stock, um, pencil cases are still in stock, um, but yeah, things are kind of getting a bit difficult to find, um, but I'm still hopeful, I still have a lot of stuff from last year, because I just did, I just ran out of time. <laughs> Which is why I'm going to start earlier this year, and not just start, you know, at the end of summer, which I think is maybe when I started. Uh, but that is my first haul for 2022. Um, I haven't really been catching up on the rest of your guys' hauls. Um, I'm kind of busy, but um, hopefully I'll get I'll get to it. See what you guys pick up and um keep up keep up the good work keep up the the sharing and the faith and um support each other and love each other uh until next time take care and god bless